how many challenges have you done? Sharon Hornelstrom here with the Supersize Your Business and Get Up and Go Challenge. And I am curious, how many challenges have you personally done, let's just say in the past year? How many have you done since COVID-19 hit in, in say March of 2020? Have you done zero, no challenges at all? Have you done one? Have you done two? And you get to decide how to define challenges. Guess what? We get to decide how to define everything and anything we want in our life. Challenges, other people's challenges, for example, online challenges, I have done probably 30 or so other people's challenges in the last year or since the beginning of COVID, at least 30. In addition, I have done eight, nine, 10, a dozen of my own challenges. I've led at least a dozen different challenges. Uh, seven of them, 30 plus day challenges because I like to do the challenge that I call get up and go because with COVID, I don't know about you, that COVID was a huge, massive change for, I would say, billions of people, if not almost everyone on the planet, was affected by the COVID-19 pandemic. And many millions of people are still being affected by the COVID-19 pandemic. As such, my natural response was to stop, freeze, and not do anything, and just wait and see how it was gonna play out, what was gonna happen next. Well, that was okay for a couple of days, but then I started to get antsy and anxious and, and say, okay, well, this isn't going to work. This is impeding what I want to do and how I want to show up in the world. So what am I going to do about it? And over the course of a couple of days, I decided I needed to continue to move forward toward my goals and objectives, no matter what was going on in, in the world. Kind of like when you're planning a picnic or an outdoor event or even a wedding or a party and you get a big giant thunderstorm or maybe even a blizzard or a snowboard. <laughs> Remember, there was a blizzard on my wedding and on my nephew's wedding as well, but people still showed up. We still made it happen. So are you going to achieve your goals and objectives despite what's going or in spite of what's going on around you, or are you just going to shut down and do nothing? I wanted to make sure I wasn't procrastinating, waiting for the world to go back to normal, which will never happen, by the way, because life is always changing. The world is always changing, and there is no real normal right there's no normal we create our own routines and rituals that makes things feel normal uh, so I needed to do something and my response was to create a challenge because I've been doing challenges for pretty much my entire life but formally for decades I've been doing them for myself and for other people and with other people so it just made sense for me to continue to challenge myself to do the best I could and to create what it is that I wanted throughout these crazy chaotic times and I wanted to bring people along with me. If I'm going to do something, I like to bring people along with me. So the purpose of this particular live video is just to let you know that the 8th free, absolutely free, of course, 30-day plus Get Up and Go Challenge is starting on August 1st. I'd like to invite you to join me. If you would like to install in your subconscious and make it automatic that any change or challenge that you personally experience results and is guaranteed to give you better results after doing the challenge than before and on autopilot meaning automatically because we're going to install a process in your subconscious that will automatically filter every change or every challenge that comes into your life through that process ensuring that you get the best possible results for you uh, and it, it takes more than a couple of minutes to describe the process and in, then to install it in our subconscious and then practice it and try it out in each of the nine different areas and aspects of our life. So that's why we have a 30 day challenge. Now, in case you're worried or what if you're wondering, is this gonna take me a ton of time? You know, you might have been in some of those challenges where somebody lectures or a group of people lecture you for hours a day and then give you hours worth of homework. I've been in one of those, I've been in a couple of those and I like them, but that's because I create my own schedule so I can make that work for me. But the vast majority of the people on this planet, even during COVID-19 and working from home and everything else or being off of work, it's, it's a challenge to make a long, high time demand challenge like that work for us, even for a short period of time. So these will be 10 minute lessons, 10 minute video every day, followed by an action item where you practice a tool or technique or strategy that we discuss in the 10 minutes and then you actually test it out and apply it in an area or aspect of your life. And, you know, it's how we become the best version of ourselves. It's how we create the life that we want uh, is by 
taking control of the things that we can control, having some systems and processes and tools at our fingertips so that when we need help with something, when we want to get through a situation better, we automatically have the skills and the abilities and the tools and the techniques and the strategies to make that happen for our lives. Why? Because nobody's going to do it for us. Nobody's going to come in and manage your life for you unless they want to manage you to create the life they want. And, and none of us want that. We all want to do our own thing. So August 1st through 31st, right here, Get Up and Go Challenge page. Please think about joining us. Short time commitment, but guaranteed to change your life. I don't know. Sounds like an awesome trade-off to me. All right. Have an awesome day. If I can help you in any way or any questions, ask in the comments below. Otherwise, I will probably pop in for another reminder tomorrow that the challenge is coming up in just a few days now. Have a great day.